For the member's statement, the member from Barrie. Thank you, Mr. Speaker. Tomorrow afternoon, I have the honour of hosting the Canadian Cancer Survivor Network reception here at Queen's Park for the fourth year. As a survivor myself, I would have appreciated having access to this wonderful resource when I was going through the treatments. The CCSN works to empower collaborative action by cancer patients, families and communities to remove barriers to optimal care. They promote health by pro providing individuals living with cancer and their caregivers with access to related counselling, information and support group pro programs. This year, they are bringing awareness to cancer-associated thrombosis. Roughly 20 per cent of the 200,000 Canadians diagnosed with cancer this year will develop blood clots during their course of treatment, and approximately 2,300 die as a result every year. Unfortunately, far too few cancer patients are aware of secondary complications such as these. I myself was not made aware of this when I was going through cancer. Many mistake symptoms of thrombosis as being normal side effects of cancer treatment and do not seek out early, life-saving intervention. Bringing awareness to these little-known aspects of cancer is an example of the important work done by the Survivor Network. Please join me in congratulating the Canadian Cancer Survivor Network for all the great work that they do, and I invite you all to come by their lunchtime reception tomorrow in room 228. Thank you.